Hello people, in this video we want to understand what probiotic is. Bio is more like life, right, living kind of a thing. Pro is some useful, pro, con, some useful biotic. That means we are going to eat or consume some microbes, some living things you are going to consume, which are going to be actually useful for you. They are beneficial for you. So basically they are trying to restore all the microbiota in you that means inside you you have a lot of microorganisms so you are going to take uh, this probiotic and restore your microbiota what is there inside you guys do you know look at this inside us there are so many organisms kind of scary actually look at this normal in the nose you have staphylococcus aureus okay let's mark in the nose we have Staphylococcus aureus. In the pharynx you have Haemophilus. Neisseria, Staph aureus. Look at this, oral streptococci. That is the alpha. Alpha is there inside, not the beta. Again, Staph aureus you will write everywhere, guys. Then, even Neisseria meningitis is there, it seems. Wow. Moraxilla is there within us. Small bubble. That is in your small intestine. So you have candida also is there. Bacteria is there. Candida that is fungus is there. Bacteria is there. Fungus is there in your small intestine guys. Did you get it? Now let's go to large intestine. Large intestine you have E. coli that everybody knows. E. coli, Klebsiella, Proteus, Enterobacter, all that we have we know. Because these are the ones that cause UTI also. I don't like these that much. But anyways, um, then you have um, some Enterococci, Fecalis, etc. Streptococcus is there even in your large intestine looks like. But these are very strange names. Never heard of them that much. Then gram positive. See, anaerobic things can sustain there because it is um, anaerobic, right? Uh, can uh, live there. It's not a respiratory tract. It's intestine. So anaerobic, you can have Clostridium. You have Clostridium within you. You have Bacteroids extra. You have Candida also. Candida lives within us. Okay. Now let's go this side. Let's uh, look at the perineum uh, for skin, etc. What are they saying? Okay. Vagina. In vagina, you have lactobacillus. Very important, right? This helps you in the maintaining the pH of vagina. Staphylococcus aureus, you can write everywhere. Candida, you can write almost everywhere, right? Then coming to the hand. Your hand itself, so many. Staphylococcus aureus, Clostridium difficile. Candida, again, they are saying. Okay. Skin. Skin, you will have coagulase negative staphylococci. Staph aureus. Corvini bacterium will be there. Oh, Corvini is bacterium is there in our on our skin. That's interesting. Propioni bacterium. Okay, some complicated names there. Now come to oral cavity. See? Mouth. Open your mouth and see streptococcus. The alpha alpha. Always write alpha. Okay. Then anaerobic is there even in oral cavity. That's kind of strange for me. Anaerobic. How can anaerobic be there in mouth? So much air will be there. Candida everywhere, you write candida guys, that's it. So scalp also you have, scalp is same as your uh, skin, okay. So all these are your normal flora, normal flora, okay. So I think in heart nothing is there, in lungs nothing is there, right. Only till pharynx they stopped. Trachea, uh, lungs and all they didn't say something is there, okay. Now, um, guys, when you take this probiotic and bite in the shop, um, what are they giving you? They are giving you, I just found something which is like a huge list. Let's look at this. They are, they are telling, they, ha they are uh, going to give you in that bottle, lactobacillus. This is what we saw in the vagina, right? Then, again, lactobacillus is some Bifidobacterium, Bacillus coagulans, Streptococcus thermophilus, Saccharomyces. Saccharomyces is a fungus, right? All this they are giving. They are saying this is not very beneficial, but they try it. They will give it for uh, bubble disorders, right? Like um, large bubble. <coughs> Just write that you will give it for treating irritable bowel syndrome. Spasmolytic they are saying, okay. But anyways, they are saying that uh, they don't totally believe that it works, okay. 
the thing what uh, one thing was confusing is there is no lactobacilli that they listed in bubble but uh, they are giving only lactobacilli looks like and lactobacilli is very common in curd so curd etc might help you just instead of buying these probiotics what do you say people so that's it about the normal flora in your body and what probiotics will do okay bye bye just one point guys if the normal flora are affected what happens you know the pathogenic bacteria will grow and this <clears throat> the fungus will start overtaking the bacteria will kind of keep the sup fungus uh, suppressed so fungus can start overtaking so all these are helpful in those ways okay